Russia is stepping up their attacks in western Ukraine near the border with Poland. Russian missiles hit a Ukrainian military base about 20 miles from the Polish border. Ukrainian officials say 35 people were killed, 134 others were injured. The base is where Ukrainian troops had trained with NATO forces in the past. But a NATO official says no personnel from the alliance were at the base. President Joe Biden has said NATO will continue to defend their territory against Russia. And some very sad news in this fight. U.S. documentary filmmaker Brett Renault has died in Ukraine. Russian forces killed him in Irpin. It's on the outskirts of Kyiv yesterday. Renault spent 20 years making documentaries. He won a Peabody Award and two Columbia DuPont Awards. He was 50 years old. Uh, we were we crossed one the first bridge in Nirpin. We're going to film other refugees leaving, mm -hmm. and we got into a car. Somebody offered to take us to the other bridge, and we crossed a checkpoint, and they start shooting at us. The bravery and the courage of these journalists, I just can't, I mean, the, new this morning, we're learning that journalist has ties here in the Valley, the one that you were just looking at. That's Juan Arredondo, and he is a visiting professor at the Walter Cronkite School of Journalism and Mass Communications at ASU, who was with Renau when the uh, attack happened. He was injured. Rondo is a photojournalist whose work has been published in the New York Times, National Geographic, Vanity Fair. A hospital official says that he is expected to be okay and survive.